guys and welcome to my channel my name is Sonia and you're watching domestic diva home today after many requests I am finally sharing with you my home gym and my home gym setup I did share one video similar to this last year but um, I'm sharing it again this year because there are a few changes few new things here and I also have will have a blog post there's several of them so I will link them down below for you to check them out so I just finished working out that's why I'm so nice and uh, rosy <laughs> but uh, let's jump right into it so if you guys follow along you know that I use my basement for my home gym well a section of my basement it is not finished um, just part of it is but I have it set up so that way I my office is over here and this is my home gym so let's get started right at the beginning so I have a treadmill and an elliptical and these are both BH fitness which are range about for treadmill fifteen hundred dollars and I think elliptical was about twelve hundred but I'm not hundred percent sure because it's been a while I will link anything that I can find links for down in the description box and then we have a punching bag and the stand is new for this year we used to have it hanging off the ceiling but it is uh, now we have a stand which in my opinion is much nicer however the stand is fairly tall so we did struggle and had to move things around to find a spot where we don't have these pipes going through and there's actually enough room and the problem was also that elliptical needed equal amount of room because when you're standing on it working out you go quite high like i'm 5'10 so i would not fit on elliptical under the the pipes and then back there is just my uh youtube storage area <laughs> don't mind the mess and then moving over here we have a bench and then i have no idea what these things are called but i will link like i said link it down below it's more of my son's equipment the a punching bag and this and i have recently bought these because i cannot do chin-ups or pull-ups or whatever they're called without some form of an assistance so that just hangs there and then he's got all of his adjustable weights and all that stuff over here so some of it he's bought himself and some of it was my husband's from back when he was younger so all of us work out to some form of an extent in my home and everybody kind of has their own needs my daughter and i do beach body but my husband and my son do their own thing so i have a lot of beach body supplies but we'll get to that in a minute so over here is um, the mats now these work great if you have them kind of wedged on things so as long as i do apologize my dogs are going nutty upstairs so as long as you have heavy things on in the corners they won't move so and but they were very affordable i got them on amazon and i think the whole thing cost around 180 dollars again i will have the links uh, the weight bend, the weight rack is brand new and I was so excited to finally get it because I hated having weights all over the place. I just bought the rack because I had most of, the, well, I had all the weights that are here. I had them already. So the weight rack came from Amazon as well. So I'm going to go over, start over here first. So I have my meditation pillow. It's just a regular pillow. I'm looking to maybe down the road pick up the proper one but for now that works most of the time i will lay down when i meditate anyways then i have weights starting at five pounds all the way up to 25 uh, if i need anything more than that which sometimes i do i will just make one from those adjustable weights and then i have my beach body ball and these are they're supposed to help you with push-ups um, they hurt me more than they help me but I think my son uses them more 
And then over here, I just have my calendar where I'm tracking all of my days that I work out and the way I do it. So if I um, close, so I have an Apple Watch and I use it. So if I close my um, calorie, uh, active calorie count, I will uh, put the whole uh, color in the whole thing. If I just did half of it, because sometimes I will put in half an hour of working out because I'll go for walks, but I will not because my calorie count is uh, active calorie burn is I think 880 calories. So sometimes on the rest days from Beach Body, I'll just go for a walk, but that's not enough to close my rings unless I've been like vacuuming the house, washing the floors and all sorts of stuff. And I don't do that every day. Then I have my, um, my board here, my, uh, what are, what are they called? Oh, I can't remember now, but anyways, um, I, this one I made last year for 2020, but we all know 2020 was a bit of a, you know what? Uh, so I just switched it around, put one in the zero, and then I have a few things I still want to add on it. And my vision board, that's what it's called, my vision board. <laughs> oh, and over here I have my track, because currently I'm doing nine-week control freak. And because I don't have a doorway, I have the track secured on this. And the bands, this one, and this one came from beach body these two came from amazon and then i just have some skipping ropes and this tension band as well and i've had those for a long time i don't quite remember where they came from and then i have my yoga mats right in the basket and i have another mat for working out right there and i spilled my energize i just saw that i forgot to my recover actually I forgot to clean that up so over here is my tv and also i like to if you watched last time i talked about diffusing oils uh, especially when i meditate i like to have some calming sense i have extra headphones in here i got this thing from a friend and i thought i know it's not holidays anymore but i thought it was really cute um, and then my TV and I actually just bought an Amazon Fire Stick because they had them on sale on Amazon and I'm using that now for st streaming my beach body. That's pretty much the only thing this gets used for and YouTube because if I'm going to do go on a treadmill or the elliptical, I'll go and watch YouTube. Otherwise, we have a TV in there for Netflix and things like that. I can put Netflix and Disney Plus and all that stuff on a fire stick, but I just haven't done so yet. Then I always have extra water bottles here. I have my big giant water bottle that I always bring down, but sometimes I need more. So I always have some of these extras here. Then I have my towels over here. And then in these drawers, I've got, I've got my sliders. These came from Amazon. My bands, they are beach body bands. And then I also have the cordless skipping rope, which came from Amazon. And then over here is for my running, all the stuff for outside for running. And this is just a yoga strap because I did run there for a while. I haven't ran for about six months on like regular basis, but once the nicer weather uh, starts and I'm planning on doing a program with Beachbody that includes running, so I will need those for sure. And then over here, I have my Beachbody binder where I keep all of my information, my measurements, my program stuff, anything that I have printed that I did not actually buy um a book on um, but printed it it's in there and then over here is just uh, my headband and i also have uh, measuring tape and then in here i have my tracking sheets for which i will work out some tracking and then just this is from control freak that came and then i have my erasable 
markers, dry erase markers. And oh, these are just boxing gloves. And I think that's it. The rest of it is just odds and ends. I think here I have all of the Disney movies. So that's not nothing to do with working out. And then moving over to here, I have my step. I've had this step for thousand years it feels like and then I have my board where I track just my calendar of what workouts I'm working out my weight tracker and it's a dry erase board but it is from Dollarama so I think I paid two dollars for it so it looks like um, a um, bristle board but it's actually dry erase which is a great thing to have because some of those dry erase boards can be pretty pricey and this one does the job and then I also have my nine week control freak rag board and then over here which kind of it's in a basket because it travels with me because I like to meditate I also have my gratitude journal in here my wellness journal and my self-care journal so i do all that and then i also have uh, my books so i try to read a chapter i've been working through this book forever i feel like because i only read either a chapter or a paragraph depending on how much time i have and then i also have my a day book of comfort and joy which i read every day and then i also have my portion fix daily log book my headphones and couple pens and uh, yeah so that's it for my workout at home gym it is very much on the budget I uh, did not spend a lot of money uh, on it like I said my machines are I would say mid-priced um, I actually did not buy the punching bag the stand or this but even if I did, they aren't like break your bank uh, supplies. I think this set was $300. Like I said, I'll have it all linked in the description box. That came from Amazon. So very, very budget friendly. And being that four of us use it, it's well worth it, in my opinion, if you have the space. And uh, all your traveling is just from upstairs to downstairs. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it inspirational uh, to for your own home gym needs. And let me know down in the comment, do you have a home gym? Um, is there anything that I'm missing that I could totally use and benefit from? Leave me a comment in the description box because I would love to know. Um, you know, if it helps, I would love to know what it is. So until next time, hope you guys have a wonderful day and thank you so much for watching.